Hello, I am Dr. Naveen Chandra. I am an interventional cardiologist. I am working currently in Columbia Asia Hospital, Whiteway. The most important thing in prevention of complication and improving the outcomes of patients with heart attack is early diagnosis and timely intervention. Now, once we make a diagnosis of a heart attack, there are the principal goal of the treatment is open up the artery which is blocked. So we have to go on and open up the artery, re-establish the flow to the heart muscles so that our in outcomes and even probably death are also prevented. Now how do we do that? There are two major concepts of treatment. One is medically we can open up the vessels or go and do an angioplasty to open up the vessels. Now in the last one era in all over the world, the standard treatment is primary angioplasty. Now what do we do? When the patient comes with a heart attack to our emergency, we directly take them to cath lab, do an angiogram, see the blocks and open up the blocks to re-establish the flow. This is what is called as primary angioplasty. Now this has to be done as early as possible. We have to do this whole procedure within one to two hours of arrival into the hospital. Now although this primary angioplasty can be done within 24 hours of onset of pain, the earlier the better. The concept of golden hour comes into play in this. When the patient comes or arrives into the emergency within 3 to 6 hours of onset of chest pain, that is called golden hour. And doing an angioplasty or an intervention during this hour, during 3 to 6 hours of onset of pain gives us the best results. It helps us optimizing his treatment, also improving his long term outcome. So in short, in summary, when the patient has a symptom suggestive of heart attack or is been diagnosed to have a heart attack by an early investigation in any one of the peripheral centers, go to the nearest cardiac center to get the most optimum treatment to get the best immediate and long term outcomes.